Hello everyone and welcome to Silverhawks Let's Play. Request mission, shall we? Um, something... Click my goalie. Something just came up. That's right up your alley. Oh, right up my alley. I've, I've compiled the information you have gathered so far from the various pirates facilities. It's my belief that we're every with everything going on we might be able to get more military funding out of these areas. The central data core will provide all the evidence we need to argue for it. Please take it to Unpa core storage for me. I have a friend there who can pass it on to the right person. Can I count on you to do the delivery? You know you can count on me. Of course. Of course. Don't forget to take that one with you when you leave. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let's take you out, Fionk. And central data core, Fionk. There we go. And before we undock, we shut all of those down and check this. Claim all. And... Ooh, Agility Boost Reward. Select all. Uh, current station, yes. You have successfully redeemed your stuff. Uh, let's see about that. Agility thingy. Ah, it's already active on my ship. Well then, let's drive very fast. In that case, let's drive very fast. Ah, oh, finally. It's just one jump this time around. So it's not 48 jumps. Uh, let's see. We got Active Booster, Air Agility Booster, Inertia Modifier 10%. Okay. Are you going to jump? Then I need to tell you to jump before you jump. My god. Is that a civilian one? Yes. Dear Lord, that's nice. I have my own station. Pionk. Undock. Maybe I should set that to... Set destination. Jumpu. Mass production. Hmm, that's nice to get that one. That's also a very nice book that I want. Allows the operation of multiple factories. Ability to run one additional manufacturing job per level. That's not a bad one.
Uh, yep, yeah, sorry. Sitting and sleeping in my chair here. I'm not sleepy. I'm kidding. Got a blue lip lipstick on you, friendo. You know that, right? Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Accept it. Complete the mission, purchase necessary item from the market. Okay, new market details. Yita is the closest one. Quantity, how many do we need? We need two. Wait a minute. What if I don't have that myself? More Mega Newton now, off the burner, I got one. So I'll buy that. Let's click Jampu. Let's click the price. Cheapest price. That one in Gita. Set this destination. Pionk. Limited social thingy. Maybe I should just buy two so I have it. It's not like 10k is that big of a sum. Yeah, when it comes to which one I prefer of these beginning quest ones. This is the least wanted. The most wanted is probably Soldier of Fortune, which was the one I did before. And then the other Pew Pew one is probably... But that's very tied to the one where you need to create stuff at auction house. Create stuff at auction house. Did I just say that? I mean, create stuff in a laboratory. Why is that showing up there? See if I should follow that one. I shouldn't be following the blue line. I guess it teaches you how to buy stuff on auction house in this quest. And auction house is basically very easy. Auction house works like any other auction house in the world, basically. The only difference is that all 
the different space stations got their own um, got their own place that they sell stuff at so you have to go to each place and buy it if you want if it sells it here and that's what what you saw there in Jita for example is where they sold it so then you just need to go to Jita and buy it well I already bought them they're lying in Jita waiting for me And that's Jita. Jita is uh, one of the best selling hubs in the world. In Eve. Uncessible jump. Gates, Jesus. There we go. That's a pirate. Drive active. The red one. Stay away from them. Nah, you don't really need to stay away from them. They usually stay away from you. In here we got the trade goods. And those are uh, things that you need when you got your own little planet with Docking resources on it. To Mega Newton of the burners. Undock. Let's fly back. Parameter. Parameter is the place that's got the uh, level uh, 1 and 2 missions. That's usually where I put down my other... Where I go when I don't play with you guys. You could set up a base on your own, out in space, where you put down like labs and stuff, in high sec. I've done that with my um, main character. That lets you... Uh, use the lab directly and uh, that's very nice because everywhere there's usually a lot of labs up. each time you try to find a lab and do stuff at the lab it's usually a long queue and again take that with a piece of salt because it might have changed but that, that was what it was during the time that I played Every place you went to, it was like three or four day of a queue before you could even get to a place. That's why you had your own base. And you could also research things there. Drive active. 
and have like a refinery to refine stuff because <clears throat> all bases don't have the the perfect refineries usually bases don't have any refinery at all I meant all bases don't have refineries <clears throat> should stop eating candy now and dock Warp drive active Warp drive active <clears throat> The next one will be a lot funner than this one I guess Cause that's exploration Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. And even though they don't go very deep into exploration, etc., they go deep enough. Or at least they did back in the old days when I was doing this the last time. Complete that mission. Thank you, Morgan Silverhawk. Something just came up. It's right up your alley. Final tests as a business. Mongol resource the opportunity to feed the war machine. You provided us with utility modules. Now it's basically building blocks of violence, weapons. I'm giving you a blueprint copy which you can fulfill my quota and the remaining products runs are yours. As this industrial class ship I'm going to reward you with. Are you ready to pass the final test, Morgan? Uh, Accept. He needs a Gatling gun, rail gun, one time seven hundred millimeter rail gun. I can actually do that right now. How many runs should I make? Nah, let's just make one run. Captain, your manufacturing job is underway. While you wait, you finish the free, explore the else New Eden has to offer. Yes, I know, I know. Can't I just buy that from the market? even cheaper my god that's a hundred is cheaper could I not see it complete quest well done Morgan here's your badge badger as promised thank you Let's have a peek at this one, shall we? Plug it in. Pionk. Show info. Bonus to charisma. Okay. That's nice. She looks a little bit hotter than before. Yeah, I'm talking about you. Let's see what we got here then. Okay, I thought I'd get like mission level 10 and get a huge benefit, but no. No. You got your badger. Be happy. Claim it to the station. Yes. Okay, let's go for the last one then. It's the explorer career. Something just came up and it's right up your alley. My god. Welcome, Morgan Silverwalk. Let's see if you can make explore out of you. Once you unlock the space, open probe scan and select the warp to button for location 
a normally training site. This is a Cosmos anomaly, which means it, it'd be easy for you to find. Warp to it and I'll give you further instructions once you made it there. Don't worry about the combat this time around. We've cleared out the area for you. Okay. Open your probe scanner and select warp. Don't I need a warp scanner? Inject that skill. I don't know, they said that I'll just do it, so I'll just do it. Do it! Do it! Probe scanner. A normally training site. Warp drive active. If I'm not getting that hair on for free, I'm very angry. You've done well. You're now inside a cosmic anomaly. Normally there would be a hostile presence, but our people have already cleared the area. All you need to do now is to recover proof of discovery document we left there. You can find one of them in the nearby training container. Training container. Open up. Fly fast. Uh, on one need a single document. It will serve as a physical proof that you have passed through the stage of this tutorial. So make sure to recover at least one. Once you have it, bring it back to me and we can move on to the advanced types of scanning. Okay. They've actually made it... made a ship blow up here with it. They're nothing if not thorough. This is the way that sites are <clears throat> when you probe scan them. There's usually a lot of NPCs flying around there and kicking your bum if you are not being uh, nice or very fast. Docking permission requested. Very fast works too. Because it takes a few seconds for the NPCs to jump in, usually. Might be have changed, I meant. Per usual. Take that with a piece of grain of salt. Uh, excellent work, Morgan. Fine, uh, normally will seem easy to you after a while, but those first steps into exploration can sometimes be overwhelming at the same. Just keep it up and I'm sure you'll do fine. Next up, I want you to run through a training area that will teach you about another type of exploration site. When you're ready for that, let me know. Ooh. That's a hero. Uh, something just came up and it's right up my alley. <gasps> Your probe scanner easily tracks cosmic anomalies. Other types of sites collective called cosmic signature would be more harder to find. And you usually need the boost to your scan to use the scan probes. These cosmic anomaly sites contain various kinds of treasures, ancient ruins to sift among, secret data files to hack into, exotic gases to collect. That's a great deal of them for explore to uncover and you need to understand how to react to each type of site. Therefore, we sent you off to complicate, complicated scans and possibility risk your ship in ensuing discovery process. I'm sending you to training facility where you'll encounter safe examples of what you might find out there. Use the ship I'm giving you Follow the instructions you're given on site and report to me after you've done. Okay. Let's 
Let's check item. Ship hanger. Ooh. Assemble ship. Make active. Fionk. Now this gives me goosebumps. This is the kind of ship that I flew and uh, scanned down wormholes with before warp to sight. This was the exact ship that I flew around in when I was going out from my horde, my wormhole base that was allocated in a wormhole and scanned down each time the wormhole changed. Greeting pilot, it's good work, work finding you way here. My name is Ruli I sorry. I will work with Sister Receive and advise it for capsuleering training. Although I'm being offered advice to go along, don't forget that you need to report back to your own agent. You've just arrived in the staging pocket of our training facility. Ahead of us is an accelerating gate. These powerful structures are able to fling your ship thousands of kilometers forward and deep inside. Ordered, ordered to operate them, you must be within two yeah, and then activate the gate. Head out through the next pocket by using it. Mm hmm. So far, I'm picking up what you bring down. Sisters of Eve is the ones we're going to do as soon as we're done with all the initial. quests. You can do the Sister of E quest, uh, I think it is every th three months or something. And you do them because you get a lot of rep with them. Exploration supplies. <clears throat> yeah, this is totally different from what I done before. Will this be a mobile platform for me so I can put it on? Maybe. <coughs> uh, sisters are the best exploration things. Although the sensor overlay can find cosmic anomalies. Please, 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 please. Although the sensor relay can find cosmic anomalies, it get it cannot get a good reading from the cosmo cosmic and signatures. Signatures are all entire different class of hidden sight. To be able to warp to them, you need to use a scanner probe. Scanning probes are de deployed much like firing missiles, but fitting in scan probe. Load the scan probe and the fire into space. Think of probes as little ships. They have built-in scanners just like yours, except they can reach out to 32 AU. You launch multiple probes 
Yada yada, as you might, uh, and you find a couple of civilian modules, supplier crates. As you imagine, using probes always allows you to cover a much larger area. First time, you'll also find a couple of civilian modules in the supply crates. Civilian data analyzed, civilian, you will need these modules in the later missions when you learn about some things you can do with the sites you'll find. You should fit them to your ship at the same time you fit the probe launcher. Take the probe and launcher as well as the civilian analyzer modules and head out into the third pocket. This area will show you data cosmic site might look like. Okay. Because some uh, nowadays you can find this kind of. Uh, Sites that you can change your gear at in space, but that was not one of them. These are actually real probes. The sisters of Eve got the. You know, inside the data might look like, yeah, that's exactly like the data one was. We just did this on the other mission. Train the of hacking when you're ready, then head through the next pocket. We demonstrate how relic site might look like. Bump. Data analyzer module. Yeah, I still don't see the difference between that one and the other one. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's what uh, it looks like when it's <coughs> that other thing, the relic, it looks like in broken husk of stuff. This area represents the gas. Hopefully all of this you learn a few things <coughs> should report back to agents. Yeah, this is a gas site. These are very nice to... Uh, you can profit a lot of money from going to the grass sites. But, 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 and a big but, and I like big but, so I cannot lie. You better make sure that when you go in to a gas site, make sure it's actually a good gas site because you can go into a bad gas site and it's worth like like 10,000 isks or something but I remember when we were grinding gas sites out in the wormhole we grinded up like 200 mil isk of gas and we sold that to the wormhole that we were in. We had a, a main uh, place where we sold stuff to when, while we were in the wormhole. And that money we got from that, we just got sent to us. <clears throat> yes, I'm done. Excellent work, Morgan. Here's a mission suited for someone of my caliber. Oh my god. Next, you'll need to scan down each type of cosmic signature. To do it, you will need your probe scanner loaded with core scope probe. Blah, blah, blah. First up is a data site, which means you 
civilian data analyzer fitted. Scan down the site with your scan probes, hack into the container, locate what with your data analyzer, then bring the content back. Please note you this training mission is perfectly safe. Fail hacking attempts in other sites may cause container to self-destruct and possibly damage to a ship. Learn more about how to use probe scanner. Visit the help section in the agency. Select explore and, and match the scanning basic video. I don't need to do that, my friend. I know this. I got this. Take it easy. Take a chill pill. Let's open you up. Let's put you in there. Then let's put you in there. And put you in there. And that's the one we need first. So I'm going to put you down there and you in there. You are going to be forced. Scan probes. Nom 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 nom. There we go. Accept the mission before we go. Proof of discovery data. Yes, sir, sir. Undock, sir. <clears throat> yeah, we sold the uh, things that we got in the wormhole. We sold to the wormhole owner, so to speak. And they took a bit of a extra cash from it. Uh, right. Now I need to go and sort this out. <clears throat> and what you could do is you could go on one of those trips when you loaded up your ships to the brink of stuff and you took stuff out and then you got the whole deal of money. Then you got the, the money from from the whole thing. Let's see here now. Tactical overlay. Orbiting camera. Scanner. Directional scanner. Probe scanner. Launch probes. We got 4 AU. Let's go to 8 AU and scan. <coughs> Let's see what we got there. Uh, Astro Belt, Astro Belt, data training was the one I was supposed to go for, I guess. Let's first bring all of these in. Recover active probes. And let's go to the data site. <clears throat> this is a training area for capsuleers studying how to scan down data signatures. Might as well reload. Because this might actually be the wrong one. It is actually not the wrong one. Good to see you're still sticking with me, pilot. You're doing well. Keep it up. Don't forget to eat the bacon. Um, <clears throat> ahead of you, you should see civil data analyzer to access it, break down its defenses to get the core, unlock it. Proof of discovery document that you need to prove the proof to find this area. Normally you should expect to find a kind of use, useful resources inside the hacking container or related process known as invention research method. Yeah, I know, as the tech 2 category. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. That's what I usually should be getting, but I'm not getting that now, am I? You shilly troglodyte. <clears throat> and these you can uh, train as well, so you become a bit better with them. Three, three, two, one. And now I now this is twenty, 
and I got 25 there so it should be working and it did not work very well because that wasn't the exit again this should be not working but it does work for some very odd reason proof of discovery pick it up put it down and dock Yeah, take two category. That's the interesting part. If you do this and it's not this proof of discovery mission, then you'll get those things that make you go for take two parts. <clears throat> those are very nice. If you're lucky, that is, of course. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. I'll just drive through the last ones and keep this episode going a bit longer. Complete. Request. Here's a mission suited for someone of your caliber. Next use your core scanner probes to find the relic site. Need a relic analyzer to hack open, you'll find the bring it back to me. Relic site loot, very useful production ship rigs. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. The ones in the top right corner left, I meant up here you got rigs them you get from uh, salvaging ships and for well relic sites let's go for you Relic training site. Let's again start by going to the that um, asteroid field. What I usually do when I'm out in wormhole space is that I. Uh, start by flying and find myself a, a good hidden position to stand and scan in and that's between two different stars or between the planets or something two different bases or something <coughs> just make sure that it's far away from anything and then I'll launch those probes and once I launch those probes, then I'll turn invisible by clicking the invisible button, which I don't have here. Probe scanner. You are at 8. Goody goody. Let's analyze. This time around we're going for relic training, and that's a relic training. Most probably. Okay, it's down there, that's perfect, because that means that I need to move these probs a bit closer, and I need to make this AU a bit smaller, that should be doable, because they should be around here somewhere. Unless it's ah, it's on, it's down there. Should have put those down a bit further then. Like that, and like that. Maybe push up to four AU. Do 
and that's that. Drag in one in. A warp. Warp drive active. This is a training area capsule studying how to scan down relic signatures. If you have any questions whatsoever, I have no problem in explaining what I'm doing right now. It's just how I'm doing this kind of... It's kind of easy. He's there with his heron, so he's doing the same thing I'm about to do. That would be the data analyzer, and that's the relic analyzer. Okay, someone just opened it, so... Okay, so I can't open it, and it's not open. <laughs> It's not openable, and I can't open it. Right oh. Come on. A module has run out of charges. Okay, maybe I need to go for a new one. No, now it rearmed itself. Usually there's other things in this, not just go through and open things up. Proof of discovery. <clears throat> there's like keys you can pick up, which means you gain a little bit of uh, extra help, you become a bit stronger and it can be like an insect that eats you and that's a virus which you shouldn't be going into but you don't know that you were about to do that, etc, etc. And that might kill you but in this training mission there's nothing like it. Complete that quest. And five out of five. Something just came up, it's right to rally. We'll provide you with a pass key into the second area. Your last assignment is to scan down a gas cloud. We've created an artificial cloud pocket for you while you usually reap it with gas cloud harvester. Our only concern is that you make it through to the second area and bring back the proof of discovery document. The materials found inside these clouds are used to be made by chemical enhancers known as boosters. In this dangerous industry populated by dangerous people, you're safe this time, but gas clouds will occasionally be inhabited by pirates. Stay alert if you're on the prowl for them. <clears throat> Bantam, I get this uh, quest reward. Let's go out. Docking permission requested. I might bring the gas passkey if I want to access the hole. There we go. Now one dock. Okay. 
gas training site again. Asteroid belt. Warp. God damn it. You can probably just push it out from where you were standing there. So just I'd rather not dilly dally when there's so many people there. That's adventure. Shoot them out. Let's put that in the middle, put that out to 8, analyze. Gas site, that's the one. It's over there somewhere, we'll go there with them. And then we'll make sure that we double check that it's actually there. And yeah, you see the red thingy shenanigan here? That's where it can be. I'm going to analyze this place again. Because it's a big round ring. Got 26% chance that to find it. Now it's a 60 and you see now it's either it's that one or it's that one. So what I used to do is I usually move directly in between them two. And since this is space I really need to move them a few times so that I actually get between them. That looks like it's kosher, yes, and then I go a bit closer, like that. Gas training site, 100% perfection. Then we will reload. Fionk. And you can either you can target it by targeting it there, or you can target it by targeting it here. And then warp to. Warp drive active. Here's the Kaski. Well done, pilot. This is the last site. I'm glad to see you made it so far. You're now inside the gas site trading area ahead of you. You should see an acceleration gate to access the second room. You'll need to have a passkey that you again place inside the item hanger. Yes, he did. This is a leaking station. Who got a little bit of gas on it I guess usually the, the gas sites don't have anything like this usually they're just uh, a pl place in space that got the clouds they're usually not leaking from places but they could I guess If you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to type it down in the comments, and I have no problem at all to. Docking permission requested. Docking request. 
explain a bit better if there's anything that I explained now that you don't understand. It's quite easy. For me, of course, since I've done this several million times. Complete that. Thank you. And that, my friends, are all the starter agents. Next time I'll be going through Sisters of Eve, I think. That will probably be the next thing I'll do. Either Sisters of Eve or it will be that I'm driving around with my main ship. I haven't really decided yet. But yeah, have a nice day. Make sure you like, subscribe and all that jazz. And catch you on the flip side. Bye bye.